Good morning and welcome to today's verse, to God be the glory. What a great day it is today. Today's verse comes to us from 1 Corinthians chapter 9, verse 19, and it says this, For though I am free from all men, I have made myself a servant to all that I might win the more. Paul here, he speaks about his willingness to surrender his personal freedoms for the sake of others. That though he is free in Christ and not bound by any man or any form of legalism, he chooses to become a slave to others, adapting to their needs and circumstances. His goal was to spread the gospel and to win people for Christ, no matter the background. This verse, it challenges us to live selfishly, putting others ahead of ourselves in order that we might share the love of Christ effectively. For us, it it might mean that we would set aside our personal preferences or privileges to connect with people from different walks of life. Paul's example encourages us as believers to prioritize the gospel and others above ourselves in order that we might reach people for Christ. In verses 20 to 22, he goes on to say, that to the Jew that he has become as a Jew to win those that are Jews, to those who are under the law as under the law, that I might win those who are under the law, to those who are without the law as without the law, but not without the law towards God, but under the law toward Christ, that I might win those who are without the law. And to the weak, he says that I have become as weak, that I might win the weak. I have become all things to all men, that by all means I might win some or save some. Can we imagine or can we identify with others who are not like us today? That is to come alongside of them and to be present with them as they are. Paul's example challenges us to get out of our comfort zone and to go to places that we probably ordinarily would not go, to the homeless, to those that are in prison, to people who don't necessarily look like us, or maybe to those whose socioeconomic status is way lower than ours, or maybe those that are socioeconomic status is way greater than ours, which would probably be even harder to do. May we, by all means necessary, do what we can to reach people for Christ. Selah, think about this. To God be the glory for the great things he has done. I pray that you would meditate on our verse today, that it would be a word of encouragement to you today, a word of challenge, something that you would put into practice. I pray that you would have a great day. Have a safe day. And then tune in again tomorrow, yes, as we consider today's verse. Amen.